pocket sent out to the lead immediately. Balto Star with his usual early flair. The Tin Man is right there. So too Bright Sky and High Chaparral. Foulbrave comes away with the leaders on the outside. Farther back in the early going, Suleimani and Storming Home and Johar will do his running from the back of the pack today as they continue their descent off the hill and head for the main course. And it is Balto Star to be the early leader, Tin Man to be his shadow. Those two head to head as they continue toward the main track here. Just in behind, Tocket has been taken off the pace. Falbrob's under a hard hold. Defending champion High Chaparral in and among horses and well held in fifth position. French Philly Bright Sky drafting in behind horses in the early stages here. Suleimani storming home still together. It's a tight pack with Johar at the back of the wall. As they move by us for the uh, first time here, up top it's Balto Star, and keeping him honest, it's the Tin Man with one circuit remaining here. High Chaparral gets a perfect spot as they move into the clubhouse turn. Tucked away neatly in behind the lead third. Falbrav is in the clear and running in fourth. Storming home gets taken wide there, and Suleimani stumbled. He got pinched back, and Suleimani stumbled, took a very bad step. They make their way around the clubhouse turn. Balto Star shattered by the Tin Man. High Chaparral kept right up there, running along in third position as the pace begins to quicken for the run down the backstretch. Falbrav still on hold, running along in fourth. Storming home, Gary Stevens fifth on the outside, running along in mid-pack, and they're running comfortably at this juncture. Bright Sky has asked for more run at the midway point down the backstretch. Suleimani, long shot, Takani is tailing off, and Johar still trailing the field. The Tin Man takes over with a half mile to go. It's the Tin Man in front, but Falbrav looms on the outside. A threatening second as they race into the far turn. High Chaparral is called on for his run as Balto Star retreats. Storming home, and Gary Stevens says go with him. They're only three lengths from the front as they approach the top of the stretch. Then Bright Sky on the inside of Suleimani. Johar watching his bid, and there's two for longs that go in the Breeders' Cup turn. And here comes Falbra, charging over the turn on the outside to cover the Tin Man. And Falbra's in front, but here comes High Chaparral. High Chaparral, the defending champ, to take it to Falbra. These two arch rivals head to head with Johar. Nick, congratulations. The defending champ comes back, and God, what a finish. Yeah, it was exciting stuff, yeah. He's he's never beat this guy. Oh, he's a hat, so huge. What kind of trip did you have? I had a nice trip. I had to hold my position, and I always had a, you know, we, we were having a, a nice run, and Falbrave was there with me, and I was happy with my position. Knew I'd get home well, because we, we'd done just nice pace, and I knew... I thought I was going to win. It just took me a while to wear Pavlio down, and fortunately, I hit the wire good. That's a nice feeling to know you're going to win. It's nice when they call it up. <laughs>